y'all couldn't hear me. Hello, <laughs> hello, Noodle. Perfect timing, love. That's what I, <laughs> that's what I was saying. Hello, hello, hello. Howdy, everyone. Nate Noodle, how you doing tonight, Nate? I saw your message. You started re-downloading Skyrim yourself. Any plans for your Skyrim run, sir? Any specific goals or anything that you're uh, that you're doing that you're working toward? I'm just curious. It doesn't really matter, but. Um, we're just going into a game I already have going because it's not like I'm doing this seriously or anything. This is just a way for me to hang out and, I don't know, do something on my birthday since we're supposed to stream tonight. But not the thing that we're supposed to be doing because what's the point of that, right? You know, <laughs> you know what I mean? So, and Chocobo's been wanting us to play Skyrim, so why not just play some random Skyrim on my level... What am I? Level 14... Um, and Dill Red Guard that I have going here. <laughs> the game is lightly modded, like I mentioned before. There's nothing crazy. It, it does have the anniversary pack, so we have, like, survival mode and stuff like that. Um, gameplay-wise, there's not a ton. The biggest mods, honestly, if we go to mod Manu configuration 519 says, Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Strem. It didn't say it the last time. Must have hit the character limit. Anyways, thank you, love. I appreciate that. <laughs> um, so we have Apocalypse spells, which honestly I'm considering taking out because I'm not sure I'm a big fan of how many spells it adds. Dragon Souls to Attributes, which is uh, a, one that I just really like. Soul Trap just adds, like, whenever you capture a soul, if it... it it's, more smartly <laughs> more intelligently there we go uh decides like what soul gem to put it in and stuff and some other little things immersive creatures actually does do a lot of stuff in adding more stuff to the game more creatures to the game uh the rest of these ones that are showing here are just hud and uh ui changes i don't have any graphical mods outside of that though um i'm trying to think if there's any other like actual gameplay changing mods i don't think so like I said, it's actually pretty pretty light with the mods. The biggest changes honestly come from the Anniversary Edition. So this is where I'm supposed to be headed. So I have a, another life, a, a new life, whatever the name of that mod is, installed as well. And I picked the Red Guard, uh, Alakir Beginning or whatever. So it spawned me over here somewhere. I don't remember where exactly. Somewhere in this general area. So I headed for the closest city to me, which is Markarth. So I've just been doing a bunch of like quests for people in Markarth and stuff like that. Um, I did eventually get a quest to go to Helgen to start like the main storyline. But since I haven't had a reason to actually go over there yet, I haven't. Um, I am tempted to go back to Markarth. Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to. <laughs> um, that's like a whole thing. I think we'll go here first, I think is where I had it. Anyways, uh, I'm tempted to go back there just to sell stuff because I have so much stuff on me. And since it is survival mode, our carry weight is only 255. And that's with the uh, backpack that I'm wearing, adding extra carry weight. Like, oh, you're a bear. Holy hell. Okay. Hopefully we don't just die here. I haven't fought a bear yet. I am only on Adept. I'm not on, like, hard mode or anything like that. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm not doing, like, all of the survival. Do we... Oh, God, we won. <laughs> not by much. Um, I'm not doing, like, all of the survival rules and stuff that I was doing in Morrowind or anything for this run. Because I am more or less just screwing around. I am, uh, trying to finish the game this time. But I am just, uh, you know, I'm playing it the way I like to play it. Not so much... Not as hardcore as I normally go, though. Because, like, yeah. Screw, what's up, my guy? Hello, hello, hello. Yes, Skyrim. I mean, we're just screwing around in it, but yes. Happy birthday, dude. Thank you so much, man. I do appreciate that. Uh, thank you for coming out and saying hello on my birthday. I appreciate it. Thank you, dude. But how is Rue tonight? That's the real question. 
Oh god, we're also freezing to death, so that's good. Uh, not that we need. Oh, not candlelight either. I'm. I know how to play Skyrim. I've <laughs> I've played it once or twice in my life. It's fun. Doing some dishing. It's fucking cold outside. Tell me about it, my guy. It's like I don't know the actual temperature, but it feels like it's like seven degrees outside or something like that. Um, where we are, it is f fucking cold. <laughs> Too cold, man. Carthwaston. Is this a town? This looks like a town. I really don't want more quests. So I'm hoping, like, no quests, but I would really like a shop. Are you a shop by any chance? You're a house. Can I steal your flowers? <laughs> you don't mind, do you? No, good. Can I steal your chicken? Just pick up the chicken and run with it? Also, steal your eggs, because stuff... Silver blood mine town. Lame. I, <laughs> I kind of want to avoid these people. I don't want to trigger another quest line. I'm trying to get like through some quests, not pick up more of them, but. Oh, not leather strips. Leather is what I want to make. Now, oh, how much leather do I have? Five. Uh, What I actually want. I saw that there was a camping kit that we could make. Oh, God, I'm unable to run. I <laughs> normally when I play games like Bethesda games, I usually like max out the amount of carry weight that I have because I hate not having any carry weight and survival mode makes that so much worse, man, but I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep the carry weight what it is and just accept it. You can take my pickaxe for me though, guy. There we go. That gives us the ability to run away. What race am I? Redguard. I am Redguard with the Alakir starting on a new life, another life, whatever the hell it's called. Um, yeah, whatever's going on here, I don't want a part of it. We're just going to climb down this mountain and head probably over that mountain <laughs> over there. <laughs> Noise? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, there's no particular reason. Normally, I do Nord because Skyrim... Um, <laughs> but I knew I didn't want to do a magic run because my last run was a magic run that I played and, uh, in the early game, magic really sucks. I didn't want to do Nord cause I've done Nord like a thousand times. Um, but then I saw the red guard and I was like, you know what? Honestly, they're like being good fighters and decent magic users. They're just like a good all around class without being too basic. I mean, they're pretty basic, but whatever point is i was like yeah they'll do they'll do and then when i got to the new life thing i saw they had the alakir starting option and i was like that's actually pretty cool so i had to go for that good there's a road we're also drained we need to take lanap but it's fine outrun the goat until we get tired White run? No. We are still going the right direction though, right? Yes. I have a problem in Skyrim. Just games like this in general. It's so hard for me to not just pick up everything along the sides of the roads and shit. It's not necessary at all, but like... Wait, is this where we're heading? It is. Okay. So let's drop a quick save. I am playing like Sword and Shield for the most part. But I do have a bow... I'm happy to use it. Uh, somebody sees me. Oh, well, okay. Oh, God. <laughs> well, you're only level six. We shouldn't have too much trouble with you. Yeah. Definitely going to need to heal afterwards, but it'll be fine. At that one Forsworn Tower? Yeah, I've been dealing with a lot of Forsworn lately. Uh, We don't really have the carrying capacity for, like, any of this stuff. I think I'm just going to leave it. Say as I pick up worthless flowers. It's fine. Nobody sees us? Nope. We in the clear. We should probably also... We're chilly. Not much I can do about that. But we're also hungry. So let's eat a little bit of food. Apple cabbage stew. Well fed. Perf. Horse form armor. Wait, what? 
Oh, <laughs> it doesn't have benefits. I got you. Yeah. I was very confused when I read that last message. It does have a benefit. It has a value to weight ratio of 17, which is pretty decent. It's a bigger tower than I was expecting whenever I decided to go here first, but it's fine. We'll do this, and then back to Markarth to drop off all our goods. Hopefully get a nap because we are very tired. Probably not going to need the sword and shield in here, actually. Oh, stuff healing equipped. There we go. Do, 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 do. Hello? Anybody home? I take it back. We have a use for the bow. Oh. <laughs> Getting warmer and are now comfortable. Thank goodness. Oh, good miss. There we go. Oh, you're only level one. That kind of makes me feel bad. Kind of, but not really. Huh? Survival mode? Ye, survival mode. I prefer survival mode in most games, but especially Bethesda games. The only thing I don't like about survival mode is how little carry weight you have. It makes sense. I know it's more realistic. I mean, even being able to carry around 250 pounds with all the stuff we do is a bit, you know, thank you for that. But like, man, I, I I love carrying stuff. I'm such a hoarder, especially in Bethesda games. So hardly being able to carry anything hurts. I'm not really trying to play a stealth archer, so I'm going to put the sword and shield away. We are full health, right? Must be. Just stealth archer always ends up being like the thing, you know? Because... Skyrim. Uh, I'll keep the iron arrows. We have a ton of Forsworn arrows. Honestly, we should probably switch back to the Forsworn arrows. Because they're not... Oh, wait. Did I drop them all already? Or am I just blind? Oh, we dropped them all already. Okay. Well, well, we're not going to pick any up. Because, yeah. They have... Wait! It's bound to happen. The stealth archer thing, it really is, man. That's the thing with, with Skyrim. Like, it's it's so hard not to be a stealth archer. Whether whether you plan on it or not, it's just like, that's going to happen. Apples are cool. They actually have a really good weight to value ratio, too. So. Ooh, some mead. Could just get drunk real quick. Anything good in the bowls? Nothing. Ugh. No, okay. My little mud crab buddy. Is this an iron arrow? It is. I'll take that back. Can I take the ones, like, out of your body? No. Lame. Nothing. Okay. The easiest and the coolest. Yeah, honestly, it is one of my favorite ways to play. It does make everything take much longer to do, of course, because, you know... You're a stealth archer, so you're taking your time to do anything. But it's just a really fun way to play the game. It really makes you feel powerful, you know? Plus, all of the benefits of, like, stealth are just really good. Um, I'm really tempted, but we have food, so I'm going to leave the food behind. I will take all of this, though. Look at this. Look at this value to wait. Can't say no to that. Tomatoes are also valuable. That's an empty barrel. Expect a lot of that. Cabbage. We'll leave the cabbage. You can make some good soup with cabbage. <laughs> Even in games, man. I'm a soup guy. I like me some soup. But soup does tend to be kind of heavy, so... Main dual wield on your first playthrough, though, surprisingly. I really like dual wielding. Um, but sword and board, the classic, you know, is what I decided to go with here. But dual wielding is a ton of fun. I like the way the perks are laid out in Skyrim because you can do, like, anything and still have a good time with it. The only one that I think sucks is magic, and that's in the early game. As you get to the late game, magic can be very, very powerful. But in the early game, it's very hard to survive as a uh, magic main. 
So sword and board with some restoration is my thing. My idea for this character, I'm not like full role playing it or anything, but my idea for the character is more or less that like he's an ex-Alakir, of course, um, as has been decided by the A New Life mod thing. Hey, I feel like... I feel like I was searching for a Debella statue for some reason. I don't remember if that was a thing or not, though. I might be crazy. Anyways, uh, so yeah, ex Alakir came to Skyrim, decided to start a new life. So my goal, personally, is to get, like, a homestead and uh, become a craftsman. So I've been working a little bit on, like, my alchemy enchanting and, um, whatchamacallit, smithing a little bit. Not a ton, but, like, as I collect the stuff and whatnot. Do the farm? I would love to do the farm. Hopefully we will get to eventually. Oh, yeah, I did find Meridia's Beacon because, of course, I did. <laughs> um... Daedra Heart. Maybe not. Maybe nobody asked me to find a statue. I'm, I, I could be crazy. See, and that's why, like, even though the iron ore isn't valuable at all, I can't bring myself to drop it because I need that for my crafting, man. And as far as I can think of, there's not in Markarth, which right now is more or less my home. The reason why I've decided to stick around Markarth and do so much stuff is because my person needs a whatchamacallit no throw it away <laughs> why do you want me to throw away the statue anyways um is because my person needs a home he's tired of sleeping out in the wilderness and whatnot being cold and shit and the uh the dude of what whatever they're called brain no work but of Markarth told me that if I did some jobs for them and became friends with the people of the city I could buy a house in the city hmm Meridia's Beacon, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not throwing it away, but once I have a place of, like, permanent storage, I'm just going to put it there, and then we'll decide if I want to, like, actually do anything with it later. Uh, I'll go ahead and poison the Scimitar. I can drop the Iron Daggers, I guess, even though I can, like, do stuff with them later. Um, I kind of want to keep the arrows. I'll drop all this Force Warm armor. It is worth money, but that'll clear up a lot of my carry weight. How much do you guys weigh? Four pounds total? I'm going to take the Iron Daggers back so I can break them down later. <laughs> hey, look. More Force Warm armor. <laughs> uh, it's going to be so hard for me to not just pick it up, man, every time I see it. Because, yeah. We're more or less safe right now. Did I, did I heal after our encounters? Yeah, I must have. Hello? People? No people. Okay. I want to, like, light the candlelight again. God, man. The freaking <laughs> physics in the game are so jank. Oh, buddy, that was close. <laughs> I did not see that on the ground. <laughs> I'm so glad I heard it and stepped back. I swear to God, if you get me killed, little dude, do not step on that. Take this. How did that sound not bother you? <laughs> There's a person right there. Did not care about that sound at all. Hotel wine's valuable. The salmon steak, we can eat that. It's good food. Just drag the plate over here. No, oh, that's just meat. Eh, whatever. Where did he go? You know what? Whatever. I don't even care. He'll show up eventually. Hi there. Can we take you? I think we can take you. I wish I could stealth behind you. That would be sick. Oh. Damn you! <laughs> Would have been good. Would have been good if we could have got it, but no luck. It's fine. Uh, no, all garbage. Some shovels, though. Look at the shovels. Stop hitting the button, bro. This is why I hate followers. 
<laughs> if followers weren't quite so stupid, they wouldn't be so bad. But, like, man. They should just be, like, hard-coded to not activate pressure plates. Mm, carrot's not very valuable. Could probably make some decent food with them. But can I sleep here? I can. That's actually really good. Uh, excuse me, there's still gold here. Some of these hitboxes are jank as hell. Stamina poison, nice. Broom? I can get a broom? Uh, Auto wine, I'll take. Enhanced stamina, cool. <laughs> I was kind of hoping it would go on my own head. That would have been fun. Frenzy poison, a strong box, <laughs> a single gold coin. Let's go. Thank you, thank you. All good. Regular wines, meh. Take the apples. We like apples. Apples are nummy. <laughs> <laughs> How the amount of damage that did to us from just dropping a bucket on our head is stupid. Is that a sweet roll? No, that's just the underside of some bread. Okay. Let's take a nap. Uh it's what, 1 10 a.m.? I'm sure it's safe in here. I feel comfortable sleeping here for seven hours. It'll be fine. <laughs> the height of realism here. You awake and feeling rested. We're probably also hungry now though. So food, stew, well fed, cool. Uh, bu bu uh, that goes back out to Skyrim. The store over here does not. We're still looking for the leader. Pretty sure that was the quest here to kill the leader. Bruh, I refuse to believe that there's nobody here. Have we... Have we been down there yet? <laughs> Are we doing a circle? Pushing a magicka, nice. over here there is i'm pretty sure we've been down there already I, I think that dead body was from us where are you you're also out to skyrim okay oh somebody around here get the carrots wait what no okay Oh, we did a circle again. I'm kind of stupid. Don't mind me. Bro, what's with all the carrots? People are obsessed with carrots. I'm obsessed with salt. Salt is really good. It's just needed in, like, every cooking recipe. Which annoys me, honestly. It's like, don't get me wrong. Salt is good. You should put salt... And pretty much all of your food that you make. But it's not necessary to just cook some meat. You could choke some meat down without any salt on it, you know? I'm like, it would be fine. Nope, nobody here. I think I'm, like, in too bright of an area to be hidden. Yep. Oh, God. Oh, those rocks sucked. <laughs> I, thought, I thought they were actually going to, like, come down and do some damage. Oh, hi. I didn't know you had a friend here, dude. I'll take that. And then, did you have anything? Probably not. 
Shitty arrows. Uh, Potion of the night. That's not bad. We'll take that. Nothing in the barrels. Well, no wonder the trap didn't work. Half these things didn't dump out. Probably heal real quick. That's candlelight. Hello? I know someone's around here somewhere. Ooh, honey nut treat. Venison's heavy. We'll leave it. Tomato soup, though? I like soup. Good soup. Nah, we'll leave it. Although I did... Mm, it's fine. You don't see me. <laughs> I'm super stealthy. Man, it never works. <laughs> You have nothing good. Okay. I don't know why I put my sword away before coming outside. It just felt like the right thing to do, I guess. I don't I don't know. Oh hi, you already see me. Another one around here somewhere. Ooh, Amethyst. Nice. Thanks for that. You can keep your leg a goat, though. You need that in the afterlife. Are you, like, on top of the tower, other person? Possible for me to get to you? Oh, oh. Ooh, maybe they're down there. Oh, well, they're not even showing up now, so I don't know. Whatever. In we go. Ah. Oh, there's the person we're looking for. Can get a shot or two out on you. That, oh. Good miss. Damn it. Level 16. Uh, this might require a healing potion or two. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, you know what? Eat a little bit of tomato soup. We're looking hungry. And then... Extra magicka? No. Some poison, though. Especially magicka poison? That seems good. Resist fire seems good. Um, our stamina is actually fine right now. So I guess now we just do health. Oh, we won this. He's so screwed. But that is exactly the reason why I usually don't let myself heal in the middle of combat. Like, <laughs> that fight became stupidly easy. The headdress is worth a decent amount. We'll take that. The dagger's tempting, too, even though it's only worth 16, but we'll take it anyways. Is there anything else in here? Version to frost. Ooh. I'll take free levels. It's a troll skull. No thank. Take the auto wine because value. Rhyna de Bella, huh? Why not? Activate it. Increase speech skill by 10 points. We might make it back to Markarth in time for that to matter. 
maybe. Should have done it like whenever we're actually leaving though. Instead of now, but too late. Dwarven plate boots? Nah, it's heavy armor. I'm doing a light armor character. Real chicken breast? 220 points of hunger? Yes. More soup? All the soup. Patats? Got the necklace? A silver emerald necklace. Very nice. Leather strips. Sweet roll. Horse meat? Mm, I think I'll leave the horse meat. And the cabbage. And the little boy's clothes. <laughs> I didn't mean to take that plate. I wanted to search the end table. Oh, whatever. We got a plate. Add it to our collection of fine china. That's it? Nothing in here? Really? What was the point of him having that key if there's nothing in here? Maybe, like, later somebody can be locked in there or something if uh, we came at a different point in time. I don't know. I think that's it. All right, cool. Back to Markarth. Do we need to... I imagine we have to, like, turn that into somebody, right? Sibyl of Debella? Yeah, I don't remember. <laughs> I've probably done the quest at some point in the, like, 600 hours or so that I've played a Skyrim... But I don't remember, man. Return to Igmund. That's what the game wants us to do. Which I'm assuming is in Markarth, right? Uh, leave it. Yeah. Or close enough to it. Should put my marker there so I remember where I'm going. I know I can't fast travel. Just put the thing here. Damn it, game. Whatever. Put it behind it then. At least it's in the same general direction. Uh, I think I can get down. Hey, there is a person over here. Look at that. just killed your leader, I'll gladly fight you too. That was a fancy move. Too bad you're gonna die anyways. Oh. Oh, this must be if we came out like that other door, doors that led to Skyrim. It must come out here. We didn't though, so we never fought any of these people. Oh. Well, before we go, like, that way, anything up here? Ooh, I can cook some food? Come on, you use? Oh, my God. Game. <laughs> can save a little bit of weight. Maybe. Probably not, actually, seeing what the weight of it is. Like, starting weight, but... Whatever, at least we have more food on us now. We're not gonna go hungry, that's for sure. Uh, base gas, iron swords. Some patats. No, I think I'll leave all of this stuff. Can we... For the experience, why not? Check you, we did. Anything on this side, or was it just one of you on each side? Looks like just one of you on each side. we we'll take a nap before we go back to Markarth, but honestly, I think we're fine. Should we, though, since we can't fast travel, we are pretty close to a couple of these other ones. Um... And I hate... Having to throw stuff away, but it'll save us so much time if we just continue on forward. So I think we'll just continue on forward. Since we do have a level up available, though, I am going to take a very short nap. I will take more... 
we haven't done any like magic yet, I don't think. But other than like restoration, I'm not really that worried about it. Stamina for the carry weight then. Lock picking. This is probably what, 25? Yeah, nope. Sneak is nice. Can we do light armor though? All light armor, we are. I will take that one then. Bonus to armor sounds really, really good. Oh, because it wants me to go through the door to get down. That's why it's telling me to go that way. I'm like, that doesn't look right, man. Right? Yeah, no, that's like the exact opposite direction. If we do a quick save and quick load, will it fix that? Yes. Good, good, good. Very good. I mean, we have, like, plenty of food and stuff, so there's no real reason to go back to town right away other than the fact that I could sell stuff instead of just dropping it whenever we inevitably end up filling up our inventory with, I don't know, iron or something else that's more or less useless. Like this right here. <laughs> Corundum. Never mind, that's not useless. Where... Where did my crab go? Hello, sir? I need my pickaxe? Oh, lord. Wait. I thought I heard him. Never mind. Thank you. I need to get something from you, actually. Not to have you carry something, but close enough. Do I have my pickaxe favorited? I do. Good. It's much quicker to just beat on it ourselves than to watch the animation. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Hi, Saber Cat. <laughs> Didn't expect you here. Uh, Frostbite Venom, why not? You're a bitch. I will gladly take that pelt though. Thank you for that. Even if that is like half of our carry weight. I'll be honest, when we randomly started getting attacked like that, I thought we spawned one of the, the thingies. I can't remember what they're called, but sometimes when you mine stuff, they can spawn. It might be part of that mod. I'm not positive, but still. Liar's Retreat? Fancy sounding place. Doesn't sound like a nice place, but I'm assuming there's going to be a bunch of not-so-friendly people in here. Yeah. You guys don't look so friendly. Surprise, surprise, they're not friendly. We can always come back here later. It's fine. We have no business here. We're just an ex alec here. We have no reason to go in there. So we're just going to ignore that. Nobody asked us to do anything about the liar's retreat. I just saw a sign for the retreat and I was like, you know what? I could use a warm bed and a fresh meal, you know. But then I found out it wasn't that kind of retreat. So we left. That's all there is to it. Can I get over this mountain? Will the game let me? It will. Thank God, man. I, I love Skyrim. Just climbing up a vertical mountainside. It's fun. Hi, bunny. Why does this look so familiar? Um, I need some way across here. Can I get down here? No, we should probably save just in case. It's fine. This this is totally fine. That's some quick water. 
It's going to be very cold too, which is not going to be good for us, but... Can we get up here? Nope. Yes, let's go, dude. I really didn't want to spend time in that cold-ass water. Oh. <laughs> Hi, not-so-friendlies. How are you guys? <laughs> Uh, I need weapons, please. You guys didn't hear that. It's fine. Nope, no one here at all. Oh god, he sees us. We are so unstealthy. Oh, yep, he, he definitely sees us, alright. Damn you. One health? Literally one health? Oh, wait, that missed you? How did that miss you? Where's the other ones? I know there's more. There's one. Can't quite see that far. Did we shoot too low? Too high? Is it hitting the geometry next to him? You know what? I give up. It's fine. It's just one dude. We can just take him. Not the pickaxe. Do your worst falls to his death. Good job. I did not mean to take the dagger, but it's fine. I'll keep. Leg of goat? No, I think we're going to have to pass on the leg of goat, but thank you for the offer, dude. I will, however, take your heart, uh, chicken eggs. And use your tanning rack. Still need some firewood. I want to make the camping gear. I'm assuming that'll let us, like, make camp when we're just out and about in case we're tired or need a level up or whatever. I'm not sure. Because I haven't been able to craft it yet. I didn't. I haven't seen any in the shop. Ooh, mushrooms. I like mushrooms. So what are we doing here? Are we just clearing the place? Reach cliff? No. No. Is it this one? Lizbeth shipment? Yes. How did you miss that? Oh, damn. You're a level 16. Oh, good miss. Oh, God. They definitely see me. Hi! <laughs> Don't mind me. Um, You're fine. I don't mind you. It's your buddy back there is the one that that worries me a little bit. Oh, shit. Are we dead or is he dead? He's dead. Oh, that scared me. Not gonna lie, man. Anytime one of those animations start, I get scared because they can just murder us out of nowhere. Uh, resist shock. Cool. Address. Yes, we have weight. Staff of hailstones. An ice crystal that shatters for 15 frost damage to health and stamina. Nice. Direct hits bypass frost resistance, too, which is awesome. Excuse me, Mr. Crab. Can you can you can you let me over you, please? Thank you. I'm assuming those were the only two dudes in here, because otherwise, um, they probably would have all came running at us. 
Why would you just leave your coin purse like here? Of all places. All the shrooms, please. Please and many thank. Oh, were you taking his heart out? I'm guessing. Kind of gross, but... A human heart. Value of zero. I refuse to believe that. Somebody. To somebody. That holds a lot of value. I definitely hear some weird, like, creepy breathing sounds. But I'm sure it's fine. Tragedy in black? Take another bear pelt. Ooh, satchel. Take you two. And the troll fat. Okay. Now we need we definitely need to drop some stuff. Uh value to weight. Uh well the pickaxe is ten pounds. Problem is there's a whole nother chest over here. And I don't know how much the stuff inside it's going to weigh. Are there any ingredients we can eat that will do anything for us? You. 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 Nordic Barnacle. Blisterwort. Amir's Rot. And Whitecap. Good stuff. <laughs> loot it. What, the chest? Oh, I'm going to loot the chest. No worries about that, my guy. Where's my crab? Come here. Need you to take my pickaxe, please. Hmm. Oh, that's why I was looking for a Debella statue. That makes sense. Madness ore? What is madness ore? I do not remember seeing that in the game. I don't know if that's one of the uh, things from like the anniversary mods or or what that is. Definitely hear like weird whispering, man. It's bugging the hell out of me. There's another cowhide. Son of a. <laughs> uh, but how much are we over by? Like one pound? Eat this cheese wheel. There we go. Ah, that's a dead end. That's not the way I thought it was. This away. getting late yeah, at this point i think we do have to go back to town just because our inventory is too full and i can use up some of our crafting supplies and crap to get rid of it we're gonna sleep until morning though pretty early morning five o'clock basically level up which is sad I'm hungry and I'm cold I mean that's fair a tomato soup and some cheese because it's heavy and cheese with soup is just a good mix can I just like warm up next to this fire yes <laughs> there we go this should warm us right up. No problems, dude. Here, we'll crouch down, get nice and close to it. Noise. I like it. Feel warmer and now comfortable. I don't think we can get, like, overheated. I think it just goes from, like, comfortable to warm, and then that's the end of it. Honestly, the, uh, like, modded in survival mod is a bit better, in my opinion, than this official one here. But 
Oh well. Give me, give me, give me, give me Cocoa Puff. Oh my lord, I want. Ah, I wish whenever. Okay, so survival mode disables fast travel, right? So since fast travel is a, a thing, I wish it would just disable it entirely and you could just put freaking waypoints down, man. <laughs> like, because <laughs> it won't let you put them down because that stupid message pops up about, hey, you can't fast travel. Like, no shit. I know that, dude. That's why I'm not trying to fast travel. I'm trying to put a thing. Also, we missed a chest. One thing I really appreciate about Skyrim compared to a lot of other games, like, say, the Fallout games, is how you can try to lockpick chests and doors and stuff, even if you don't technically have the skill for it. It's just much harder to do so. I really appreciate that. I wish more games were like that. Now, the real question is, is this going to add to our weight? Or remove it? It added. It added a lot. <laughs> God damn it. All right. Well, I guess we're dropping something. Worst part is I thought that was going to happen, but I was like, yeah, I'm sure it'll be fine. Yeah, because the cowhide has a way to two. It makes multiple pieces of leather, each of which has a way to two. Dumb to dumb, dumb, dumb. Um, I guess we can drop. Well, we can definitely drop the plate. The single force worn arrow that I picked up by accident. Uh, I don't even think I have the skill to work with Dwarven stuff right now. So I guess we can drop them as well. There we go. Now, no more picking stuff up, man. Just, just go back to Markarth, damn it. Oh, flowers. Hold on. <laughs> flowers don't count as a thing we can't pick up. I'm drained? Bro, I literally just woke up, did I not? From like a 12-hour nap? How the hell am I drained? Oh, hi. Mud crab. I don't want to go out there. You're going to make me cold. Hmm, crab meat though. Hmm, crafting ingredients. We have weight. It's fine. What are you? Are you a fish? You're a mean fish. Gib? <laughs> okay. Wait, what is this? What are you? Are you on the map? You're not on the map. You don't seem to be evil. I don't... Armstall? Hmm, I'm assuming you're some sort of, like, bandit base or something. We're probably just gonna leave. Oh, like a mine? I don't suppose you're a friendly mine, right? Okay, even though you're called an adventurer... Even though you're called an adventurer, I don't think you're the friendly sort of adventurer, so we're leaving. I did sleep all night, right? Yeah. So why are we drained? That's dumb. Oh. <laughs> Bruh, these little, like, battles that happen out in the world are great for, like, free loot. We have no weight, so I'm not really going to pick anything up, but, like... Close enough. Ah, don't worry about me, Mr. Forsworn. I'm just looting the dead. Oh, I will take that iron arrow, actually. Gold. I'm backing off. Oh, wait, Juniper? 
Sorry, I have a problem. I can't help but pick berries when I see them. I'm leaving. How pretty the sky is. What are... What is going on up here? Oh shit, are you mad? You're mad, okay. Sorry. When I saw you guys, I thought you wanted some help. Holy shit, we're about to die. Um items. Sort by type. That was whatever, it's fine. Uh sort by value and then type. <laughs> That's what I meant to do. Potions are friends except for the useless ones. Very much so. Uh da da da. Stamina, I guess just Frostbite Venom. Oh, you were much closer to dead than I thought. Uh, I guess that was kind of dumb, but... You have a bunch of arrows, but I don't think I have the weight for it. That staff weighed eight? Well, shit, if I'm going to have to drop things anyways, then give me your arrows. Oh, and bone meal. Staff of Sparks. Why are these staves so heavy? They're staves, man. They're like made of wood. Khajiit skull? That's... Alright then. God, we have so much stuff to drop. I know I'm carrying too much game. Thank God the gold doesn't weigh anything. Could you imagine? Just want to get to you over there. To see what I'm looting from you. Probably a pelt. And an eyeball, I'm guessing. You are a saber tooth, right? I'll bristle back. Never mind then. Uh, We'll just take that. Alright. Items, everything... What can we get rid of? I need the leather. We can drop the daggers. I didn't mean to equip it. Nord arrows are 10. You're 8. I don't have very many arrows. Well, I have all these fire arrows. And steel arrows. Honestly, we have a Thank fair you, bit of arrows. We Batman can probably drop them. For following. Hey, thank you, man. I appreciate that. Yeah, so screw it. Let's drop the iron arrows. Then just equip. I mean, fire arrows conditionally like could be very good, but they have lower damage than the rest of them, so I'm going to equip those ones. Still need to get rid of 10 more pounds, though. Don't want to get rid of the any of the crafting ingredients, really. I don't think we're really hungry, but we'll eat some stuff. Uh, uh, sweet roll. Sure, screw it. Eat it. And I guess, I guess the wine. I don't have very many mods. It's lightly modded right now. I am playing on PC, obviously, but I'm not playing with very many mods at the moment. Uh, apparently I stole some shoes at some point, so we can just drop that. Um... Oh, did you just boot up the game, Nate? Yeah, the anniversary stuff takes a bit <laughs> to install. Oh, shit. We need to drop two. There we go. Yeah, the download speed isn't uh, particularly high on it, sadly. And there's a fair bit of it in there, so it definitely takes a minute. Captive? Wait, did I miss, like, a camp over here or anything? No, I did miss some iron ore, though. 
Damn you. I'm going to ignore it. It's fine. I don't have... I don't have the carry capacity for it. We're just going to have to pretend we never saw the iron ore. At the end of the day, it is just iron ore. Surely somebody in Markarth sells some iron ore. Maybe the... Uh, I can't remember the dude's name. But the smith dude that lives in the, the reach. It's moving surprisingly fast. Yeah, I mean, most of them don't take too long, but just because of like the sheer number of them that there are, and then a couple of them are larger mods... So a couple of them take much longer than the others, sadly, but it doesn't take, like, super long. It's just whenever I was working on getting, like, my actual mods, the handful that I have, um, whenever I was trying to get them to work, I ended up having to reinstall the anniversary ones a good handful of times, which was super annoying. Uh, where are we? Not anywhere I care to be. Although, you look very familiar. I'm sure I've been here before. But again, where Endil, I think is what my name is. I honestly forget. We have no reason to explore that area right now, so we're just going to not do that. Instead, we're just going to play Amateur Mountain Climber and... Yes, I forget my name. Do you know who I am, Rune? <laughs> I forget everything. Hold on. What is our name? Doesn't it say here somewhere? Yeah, there it is. Endil. See, I had it. I knew what my name was. It's no problem. Sadly affecting me now. Not make my mod 2 work. I apologize. You got both games? I'm not 100% sure what you're saying, man. Why are you just chilling over there? Oh, oh we don't have our sword equipped. Sadly, you're going to drop a pelt that I want. Why run? You're dead. Thankfully, your pelt's not that heavy. We can drop just another... Where was it? Definitely not my dwarven bolts. Oh, these stolen fine clothes. We can drop those. Will that let me... Nope, we must be, like, fractions of a weight too high. Uh, We're probably getting hungry by now. Eat some beef stew. There we go. Now we Gucci. Goat. I'm leaving the go hide. I'm I'm so tired of the <laughs> not being able to carry stuff. I'm hoping like as we get farther into the game, some of the backpacks will offer more carry weight than the I think it's what is it, 75 pounds that the one we're wearing offers, which honestly is a fair bit, but like yeah. It would be nice if we could carry even more. Oh, God. Um, you know what? I have no reason to fight you, Frost Troll. Other than the fact that I feel like I shouldn't leave you here. Are you chasing me? Of course you are. The bristle back! Get him! <laughs> Get him! Hey, thank you for the five bits, Noodle. Appreciate that, love. You prefer soup to stew? I like both. Oh, okay, yeah. That bristle back did not stand a chance. Sorry, snowberries have to collect. Okay, I'm leaving now. <laughs> Don't mind me, Mr. Fro- Oh, God. Just keep running. Just keep running. What is this? Sadly, they look like more angry people. Which is not what I want. Why is everybody so angry in this game, man? All I know is it's very cold up here, so are you willing to be my friend? Are you a drogger? <laughs> if so, I don't think you're going to be my friend. This is what we get for leaving the road. Oh. You see me? You see me. 
Wait, do you see me? Yes, okay. It's fine. I don't mind fighting a couple Draugr. Where's the other one at? There he is. Whatever you say, Mr. Draugr, sir. Take your gold and your bone meal, and I probably can't walk now. Yep. Saw that coming. Or can't run. What, do you not like bow, love? What's wrong with the bow? I think bow looks fun. Mm. Screw it. It's time. Drop the iron dagger. You can keep everything. I don't need any of your crap. All right, now where's the road, damn it? We need to get back on the road. Where it's at least a little bit safer. Open, like... Does this road cut through the mountain here towards Markarth? That's what it looks like, at least. Wait. Oh, is it just like a switchback? Long as it goes around or above or through the mountain or whatever, that's fine. Probably heal while we're just running around. Oh. Bro, you don't want to fight me. Yeah, you're chill. You're chill. Good little... I almost called it a horse. <laughs> Good little... Ah, Good little piggy. There's chili here. I wonder why. <laughs> it's not like we're in the middle of the mountains, the snow-covered mountains at that. I mean, we are dressed pretty well, I think, for the mountains, you know? I feel like, uh, I mean, I guess we're not wearing much in the way of, like, furs, but we're not, like, naked at least. Friend or foe? Or just empty. I mean, empty's fine. Looks like an old Forsworn camp. Yeah, definitely. Hey, don't make the naked people pants. <laughs> I think you meant don't hate the naked people pants suck. I think is what you were trying to say. Holy crap. Did we hit a trap? Oh, hi. Oh, you're a Hagraven, aren't you? I mean, I can fight you. But I'd really rather not risk it. Oh my god, dude. You have to run out of magic at some point. Yeah, you stop sneaking and just run. Oh my god. <laughs> this hag raven sucks. How are you still shooting me? Okay. Okay. What either lost me or it can't shoot me from here. <laughs> so here's the plan. We quick save, we heal what we can, and then we run down the side of this mountain and just try to get past it. We are very cold. That's good. You can die from the cold, so we definitely want to get, like, out of the cold. Oh, God. Oh, sh okay. We're fine. We might have broke a leg, but we're fine. <laughs> Jesus, man. Oh, good miss, Hagraven. Bro, we were following the road specifically so crap like this wouldn't happen. Wait, is that... Is that Markarth? Let's go, dude. <laughs> Wait, is it more ruins? No, that's Markarth. Okay. We just got to get down without dying. Or like accidentally clipping through the world. I've done that a couple of times playing Skyrim. Ah, uh, okay. You know what? Fair. They are technically ruins. Oh, okay. We're fine. Why battle music?
The hag raven didn't find me somehow, right? <laughs> I don't think it did. I think we're fine. Oh, thank goodness. Civilization. I've learned a valuable lesson about staying on the freaking roads. And you know what? We're kind of rich. We have... How much gold? 7,956. Please someone do something? Wait, what? Is somebody being attacked? I don't know. I think it's fun. The dog seems a little angry, but whatever. Are you willing to talk to me, Stu? Yes. Because technically the, ha the hag raven's too far away. It's fun. <laughs> Buy a wild horse map? Uh, sure. Why not? That's part of the anniversary DLC, I believe. I mean, if we can tame horses, then I kind of would like to do that. Hail Mare, Red Horse, White Spotted Horse, Dapple Brown. Is that all of them? Any of them, like, near here? Oh, there's a lot of them. Oh, they don't show up on, like, the map map, do they? Oh, I mean, that makes sense, I guess. All right, well, let's check the note, then. Because surely the note has something about it. Is it the wild horses notes? Near Markarth, north of Salvius Farm. Yeah, okay. So we actually have to, like, find it out in the wild. Hmm. I think we'll just buy one. Wait, what'd that say? I had a coin, or the coin. I'd hire a wizard to use Detect Life and help me find these horses. Uh, so I'm guessing that's, like, a hint on how we can do it. In the meantime, though, I'd like to just buy a horse. Yep, here's a thousand golden. I'd like to change my horse's saddle. Imperial Stormcloak. Um... Standard's fine. Is this one mine? No. Stop freaking out, man. You're fine. This is my horse. You look like a cool dude. I'll leave you here at the stables for now, though. Go inside where we can warm up a bit. Get a good night's rest in, like, an actual inn on a real bed, not in the middle of a campsite or whatever. Sell some stuff, turn in a couple quests, all that good stuff. I like it. I like it. Hello, Lisbet. I found your statue. Seven hundred and fifty gold. That pretty much paid for the horse. Uh, what have you got for sale? Honestly, I don't care that much. I want to sell you stuff. Um, ba -bum -bum -bum. Let me let a talus. Okay, you know what? Okay, I can sell you all of these. Will that let me run around easily enough? It will. Because what I actually should do... Well... Oh my god. Bro, I'm not being attacked in here. The hag raven or whatever is like way outside, man. If I save and reload, will it fix it? Apparently not. Well, okay. <laughs> Damn you, game. Skyrim, you're a beautiful, stupid game. <laughs> Whatever. I'm gonna go here to the underkeep. Do my crafting stuff, and then we'll sell afterwards. Because I need to disenchant some of these things and... Oh, before I go in there though, I need to... Go to the smelter down here and smelt any ores that I have. Uh, 
So angry they are. Is there a closer smelter? There might be, but whatever. I know there's one down here, so. And I, I'm not in combat, game! Bruh, is the game just gonna perpetually think I'm in combat? What if I wait? Wait, it wouldn't let me wait if I was in combat, right? I don't know, whatever. Smelt, smelt, smelt. What is Madness Ore? I do not remember Madness Ore, man. Hopefully it's like actually cleared up now, the stupid combat thing. Ah, uh, here's... Oh no, that's a forge. Ah, eh, whatever. Can't do anything here. Uh, animal collar, banded iron. Ooh, we can make some elven gauntlets. Or elven things in general. What has the best... We go to the armor tab. Actually, you know what I really want is a new weapon. Damage 21. What's my current weapon? Not sure. But the elven sword has to be better than the basic ass scimitar that I have, so... So let's take the elven sword, yes. Okay, so I guess it's the same, but this is uh, improved, whereas the Elven Sword's not, so. Elven Sword, and then we probably need Moonstone to refine it. Yeah. So no refining of it right now, but hey, it's the same quality as what we had. But with room for improvement. Whatever has the best value to wait. Silver jewel necklace, cool. Amethyst ring, sure. Venture's backpack. What do you take? You take corundum ingots? Mm. Orc ball barrow. See, I want the camping supplies. Build a campsite when outdoors, but I haven't found any firewood anywhere. Leather scout helmet. I don't think... There's no, like, armor I can make that's better than what I have, right? Pretty sure the scout stuff is what I have right now. Yeah, I know. Netch leather? Um, we need to go to Morrowind. Um, okay. For sure, just make whatever has the highest value to wait, then. Mm, I'll skip the nails and crap like that. Chocobo, hello, sir. And then, do we have anything? We can improve the iron plate helm. Do that, then. There we go. Oh, we have a tanning rack here. I didn't see that. Create, 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 create. It's very chilly. Very, very chilly. How many leather strips do we have? I don't know. We can make a couple, though. Does that give us space to make anything else? Problem is, I enchanted, like, all of my gear I shouldn't have, but whatever. It's too late. Um... Oh, wait. I never enchanted my helmet? Cool. Okay. Superior, then. And then... Do more just for XP. Uh, excuse me. I would like to use the forge. I realize you're using it, but <laughs> I'm more important, so off with you.
nope, nope. <laughs> you thought you were going to use that. Okay, I take it back. You can have it. Bye. Let's go upstairs. Go sell all this crap now. And disenchant stuff. I almost forgot about disenchanting. The hag's cure? What is this? Bro, I don't think I've ever been in here before. Well, hello, people. <laughs> Your skull is kind of going crazy over there. Will you buy any of my crap that I don't want? Like this frenzy poison? Or more frenzy poison? Stamina poison. You can have all the poisons. Honestly, I've never been a big fan of poisons. Sort by type. I don't want to sell you any ingredients. Um, I'll just read the recipe. It's fine. Should have drank that before. I, before I just did the blacksmithing stuff, but it's fine. Fortify lockpick could come in handy. Screw the poison. I don't use two-handed weapons. I don't use heavy armor. Uh, I do do some magicka. Not much, though. I'm keeping my food. Am I keeping this much food? No, I have too much food. You can have the green apples. Or actually, the apples in general. There we go. I guess I should actually see what you have for sale. You sell apple pie? Really? <laughs> okay, why not? More blacksmith stuff. Hmm. <laughs> I am good, by my way, guy. Sorry, I didn't read your other message till now. Uh, <laughs> I No, I'm good. I'm tired, of course, as per usual. But today's been a good day. And we're playing Skyrim. You can't have a bad time by playing Skyrim. So, like... Unlike ESO, you don't get set bonus. So, I would wear one piece of heavy armor for EXP. Uh, you do get set bonuses in Skyrim. Ugh. Not by default, of course. But if you go to skills and then you go to light armor and then you go to custom fit, armor bonus of wearing all light armor. So I'd lose 25% of my armor if I switch to heavy armor. <laughs> what do you mean who upgrades armor? <laughs> <laughs> Light armor becomes just as strong as heavy armor if you upgrade it all the way. You've never seen that in your 400 hour? Do you? <laughs> really? I always upgrade my armor, man. Not gonna lie. Big armor upgrader. <laughs> I don't think we need that. Okay. I don't think there's anything in here we need. Oh, we can ask you about the Forsworn? Hold on. You're going to end up giving me a quest, though, aren't you? Uh, okay. And what about the Hag's Cure? Luckily enough, I plan on going that way anyway, so yeah, I will. The Stallion's Potion? Wink. I'm not stealing anything from you. I am playing a somewhat lawful character, but I am very interested in your home here. I don't think... Somehow I think I've never been in here before. That's your wife? <laughs> Wait, like, is that actually who you married in the game? I mean, she's cute. I get it. <laughs> the hag, right? That's... <laughs> Seriously, though, I don't think I've ever been in here before. I don't know how. This playthrough, I've only been playing for... Oh, I don't know. Not that long. Do I really not have... Restore health stuff? Gross. Well.
Let's make a bunch of failed potions to learn more about stuff. Hey, restore health. Cool. Look at that. Human heart. Magicka regen. Very good. Mud crab chitin. Oatmeal briar heart. Absolutely nothing. What build? Uh, sword and board for the most part. But I'm light role playing, no serious role play or anything like that. Uh, but yeah, since I did like the new life start thing as a red guard Alakir X Alakir, I uh, wherever it dropped me, I just went to like the closest city or worked my way to the closest city, and I'm now just like doing quests for money and things. But then once I got some money saved up, I asked about getting a house because obviously I need somewhere to live. And the the dude... Oh, shit. Didn't mean to make that. I can't remember his name or what they're called. The dudes that run the big keeps. <laughs> he told me, like, he won't sell me a house unless I do some jobs for him. So, so now I'm doing jobs for, for the townsfolk so I can try and get a house. I did get the quest to go to Helgen, so I could officially start... Oh, regen health. You know what? I'm going to make a few of those. I could officially start the uh, main quest line now. And it would work with the light roleplay. Um, because, you know, I have a quest to go there. A reason to go there now. But I've decided that I'm in no rush for it. Which is probably a bad thing. Because that's why I never fucking finish any Elder Scrolls games. But you know what? It's fine. We fall sparrows pounds for you, Carl's. Yarl's. Car? No, it's not Carl's. <laughs> There's a, I refuse to believe it. <laughs> it's, it's Yarl or something like that, right? <laughs> it's not. It's not. <laughs> hmm. Very sus. Uh, not the runes. Hall of the Dead, that's fine. I want to get to the enchanting table anyways, which is through here somewhere. Is it this way? I think it's this way. Who are you? Oh, you must be brother or whatever. Because I cleared the place out for you, yeah. Aha, here we are. This is the door. Under Stone Keep. Yeah, I'm working, I'm working towards getting the house here. I'm just doing quests for him and shit. Enchanter, I would like to disenchant stuff. Uh, but anyways, as far as my character itself, he's a uh, craftsman that uses sword and board. And of course, stealth archer as a backup because, let's be honest, um, who wouldn't use stealth archer as a backup? Lily, thank you. Lele attack just redeemed hydrate. It's that uh, Mexican mudslide that Noodle was going to bring, but didn't. Why not get free house? Is there a free house in Markarth? Uh, I'm fine with breaking all of this stuff. Really should have worn that whenever I was improving my stuff too, but whatever. I'm tempted to destroy this, but I don't have a better shield to replace it with right now, so... I think we won't. Are there any enchantments that I want? I mean, the smithing wouldn't be bad. But it's kind of useless to me at the moment. I might as well do it for the XP. How much would a Grand Soul gem? It would still only make it 1%. So no, definitely do Petty then. <laughs> Craft, yes. I guess it really doesn't matter. I'm just doing this for XP right now anyways. Now I wonder... If I do this to a stolen item... Does it still count as stolen, I wonder? I have a lot of jewelry, I just realized, too. Smithing. 
I'm gonna keep the grand soul gem, but I'm willing to waste the rest of them to level up. Oh. Uh, smithing. Yas. I'm hoping it clears the thingy off of them. I don't know if it does or not, but... Uh, what do I have? Do I care enough about improving this any farther than superior? No. So what can we do for you? Soul Trap wouldn't be terrible. I do need soul gems if I'm going to keep... Yeah. Um, one second's fun. Do I want to use the grand on that? How many charges does that give me? I guess it doesn't say here. I'll just use greater. That's fun. What's the... What's the free house here in Markarth? I don't know if I remember that. I don't think I do. Hey, we're up to 2% better. <laughs> Still not worth, though. I need to increase my enchanting levels some. But I've been more focused on survivability in the early game here. Most of vendors by entrance, abandoned house. So it's not officially your house, though, right? It's just somewhere you can safely drop your crap. Uh, yeah, sell, 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 sell all of this crap. Oh, you're out of gold. Um, I don't... Is there anything I want from you? Do you have any healing potions? You don't sell potions at all, do you? Nope. Uh, soul gems. Do you have any soul gems? You do. I will take a bunch of soul gems. Empty soul gems, specifically. It's yours once you do the quest. <laughs> once you complete a quest, technically, yes and no. Wait, are you talking about the one that, like, you go down into the basement... Because it's like being haunted or whatever by the one Daedric Prince. I forget the person. Are you talking about that one? Like you don't get the deed to the house. Yeah. Okay. 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 I see what you're saying. Yeah. I mean, that's a good idea of a place to just drop my crap, I guess, that I didn't think of. If there's any stuff I want to drop. What are you? I'm not sure someone helps above 50. Oh. Keep that, I guess. Mm, I don't care. It's fine. I'm selling it to you. Get it out of my inventory. Oh, did you say it too? I'm sorry. I can't scroll up right now because Skyrim has my mouse locked. But <laughs> it's, I believe you though. <laughs> you, do I want the crackers? No, it's fine. You can have the crackers, love. I would like vendor, please. Actually, before I do vendor, let's give this dude his quote unquote stallion potion. If you'll excuse me, I have a city. Thank you. Will you talk to me about me buying a house now? No. Why do you hate me, you dick? His house. Well, Bruh. I might just end up using that house, like, anyways. Am I going anywhere for vacay? Yes, I'm leaving the day after tomorrow. So, there's a very small possibility that I will... I know you need to be a Thane, but I don't know what I have to do to become a Thane here because it's been a long time since I played. Anyways, that's besides the point. Um, I am going somewhere for vacation. Uh, I'll be leaving the day after tomorrow. 
staying home today, the actual day of my birthday, and hopefully not doing shit. And then I'll be gone until Friday. So there might be like a random stream or something tomorrow just because, yeah, uh, I'll be home. So why not? But I won't be doing anything Tuesday night, right? Yeah. When we would normally be streaming because I won't be home. Happy B day. Well, thank you, my guy. I do appreciate it. Uh, it was a sword we made. Some grindstone. Elven sword superior. I mean, we might as well. Item. Whatever. Because I'm never going to use these things. Because I'm always going to forget about them. So where's the blacksmith drought? 18% better for 30 seconds. Elven sword. Beautiful. Craft. Yes. And then, oh god, quickly now. I don't think there's anything on the workbench I can do. Nope. Back, back, back. Uh, forge. Oh, I can make an elven bow! <laughs> Annoying, because I literally just enchanted the one. Do I have time to get over and improve it before the thingy wears out? No. No. I don't have the stuff anyways. I need more refined moonstone. Lame. Always want to marry Moth, but you never do. Is he a marriage candidate? I have no idea who the marriage candidates are and aren't in the game. He is nice. Why don't you do it then, man? Go for it. Not going camping, are you? Noodle refuses to cold weather camp again. <laughs> I got her to do it once and she absolutely hated it, so I don't think I'm ever going to get her to do it again, but <laughs> damn it, I'll still try. But no, like she said, we're going glamping. We're going to a cabin, basically. Chated you for like a week? No kidding, man. Uh, sell, sell. Madness, or I still don't know what the madness is stuff is. I do not remember those being in the game. Nothing else you'll buy from me. It doesn't appear so. That I want to sell at least. Should I armor my horse? Hold on. It's a total waste of money, but Elven. I mean, I'm wearing Elven. There we go. Got that horse armor DLC, my guys. You know it. I was frozen. You did not almost freeze to death. You were fine. He kissed me in the middle of the night and told me my nose was cold and I had a spider on my leg. Not a spider on your leg. Uh, no, I don't believe I've gotten anything with calm yet. When I got her to go cold weather camping, we didn't have a uh, cabin. We were just in the tent. But honestly, I had to like unzip my sleeping bag because it got pretty warm a couple of times. Yeah, no calm yet. Oh, I do need to soul trap my elven bow, though. Since I'm going to switch to that. Probably. It feels terrible to use a grand soul gem on soul trap, but screw it. Let's go. <laughs> I would divorce you. <laughs> it's not that bad. Okay, so technically the Force Horn is better, but it's superior. So once we're able to upgrade the Elven Bow, it'll be the better one. I'm going to switch to it. Good stuff. Push myself again so when I'm sleeping, I don't sleep well when I can't. Yeah, it's true. She struggles in general, honestly, but especially when I'm not around. She's obsessed. Go sell my shit. And then, yeah, in the meantime, I will use that house that y'all were talking about as a uh, storage location at the very least because it just makes sense. And I need somewhere to drop my stuff. <laughs> when I'm on your doorstep, you'll know he made me cold camp again. You're terrible. Why? Oh, oh I'm buying. I'm like, why do I have all this straw and crap? 
Uh, buh, 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 buh. you know what? Let's just go through the categories. There's actually not that much left for me to sell, is there? Uh, type. Hmm, lock picking, resist frost, whatever. It could come in handy, but I don't care that much. Oh, well, you're already out of money. Good stuff. I don't think you have anything I want, right? Hailstone, lesser ward. Um, <laughs> the bounty that I sold you. Oh, you have some soul gems. I'll take your empty soul gems. There we go. And then I can sell you more stuff. So I have all kinds of stuff. I don't really use Magicka that much. I'm going to sell some of these. Actually, I'm going to sell them all. I lied. Hmm. Keep that, I suppose. Do I keep these for crafting? Make them worth more? No. No, I don't. Okay, there you go. There's all your money gone. Oh, yeah, I didn't change question of the day. It's my vacation week. I'm being lazy. It's fun. <laughs> don't worry, I've got a nice warm house here. Mm, 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 mm. It honestly, like, outside... Of the, uh, whatchamacallit. Outside of the, the sleeping bag, it did get cold, yes. But in the sleeping bag, honestly, it was super warm, man. This house is a mess. Uh, we don't have an eight ball, sorry. <laughs> I've never had an eight ball, man. <laughs> I don't even think that's an option with, like, the default crap from, uh, whatchamacallit. I thought you didn't know. I'd never had an eight ball. Not that I can remember, at least. Oh, there is an 8-ball. <laughs> Wait a second. Hold on. Hold on. What happened? Did, did it break? I have to tab out here real quick. Is the bot working at all? That's the real question. I do not remember having an 8-ball. The bot says it's on. Uh, eight ball default search eight ball permission everyone it says it's a thing Maybe, I, I bet you have to do exclamation mark, eight ball, did stream do a thing, question mark. Yeah. <laughs> Will I get a car next week? Sure, lol. Yeah. <laughs> I believe in you, Ru. You got this. Yeah, you have to do eight ball and then question. That's the thing. All right, uh, empty, corundum or iron ingots, madness ingot, I guess. Map of wild horses. Am I gonna actually try and go find a horse right now? Probably not. Never mind, cannot remove it. Radius beacon, can't get rid of it. Um, can get rid of all these ingots and crap though. Flawed Varla stone? I don't even know what that is. Maybe I'll get my license? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Congrats on passing your test though, Rue. <laughs> Ice man. Uh, dinner invitation? When did I receive a dinner invitation? Can I drop that? No. Why is it a quest item that has weight? That's so dumb. Quest items should not have weight. I think I'm keeping everything else. Well, I guess I should probably drop the like blacksmithing potion because in here because i'm only going to use that whenever you know and i should probably just get rid of these stolen things but who knows maybe i'll find someone eventually that'll buy it 
Okay. That's good enough. We've dropped 130 pounds, so I'll I'll take it. Now there is a bed in here somewhere, right? Yeah. Take a nice 12 hour nap, why not? It's Creation Club Quest, yeah. I mean I, I figured it was. Although my memory is terrible, I do have hundreds of hours in Skyrim, minus all of the newer Creation Club content, so uh more stamina and nah, more survivability, I guess. As much as I want more um, carry weight, I don't need the carry weight. It's been so tempting to take the archery stuff, but like, I'm not a stealth archer. As tempting as, tempting as it is, I'm not one. Okay, nothing else I can do in one-handed. Can't do anything with block. Steel smithing. Can't do arcane. Advanced armors is an intel 50. Enchanting, though. Enchanting wouldn't be a bad idea. Restoration, I could get better healing spells. Hmm. Healing spells in general cure 50% more is pretty good. I don't really care about the speechcraft stuff. Money never ends up being a problem, so, like... I mean, that's handy, and then Investor is handy, as well as Master Trader, but, like, other than that, I don't really care about the speech stuff. Lockpicking's handy, too, I guess, but my skill's not quite there. It's what a calm sword is for. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I can't argue with that, man. Yeah, true. All right, looks like enchanting it is. It's the only thing we can really increase right now. Or restoration, but... Again, I'm soft role-playing a craftsman, so... Increasing crafting stuff makes sense. Yes, I know I'm hungry. Game, let me eat food. Do I have anything cooked? What's the heaviest thing? I guess it doesn't really matter. Still peckish? Man, I was hungry hungry. Satiated uh, salmon steak. There we go. Well fed. Is there a cooking pot in here? I remember like there's this stuff. Cooking ingredients. You don't think so? No, I don't think there is either. Not that I can remember at least. There is a hearth upstairs though, right? Oh god, it's so tempting to take the cabbage, but... It's dumb. I don't need the cabbage. Oh, wait. Can I cook in it? No. Bro, that's so dumb. I need a mod just to change that. That one thing. All right. Whatever. Go an enemy while calm. There's a chance they will leave you an inheritance. I know. I've seen that uh, on Reddit just recently, actually. I've seen that pop up. Where people get inheritance from their quote-unquote friends. But it's just because they killed people with like a calming sword or bow or whatever. And it's like... <laughs> oh, man. I'm going to quick save, actually. Because being on a horse in this game scares me. Isn't there a way to make your horse like run? Faster? Is that not a thing? I guess that is the faster run. You gotta go. Take a take a good night. <laughs> Have a good night, room. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, can't they jump too? Yes. It's been a while. I don't usually ride horses in Skyrim. Take a good night. Take a good night, man. <laughs> Thank you for stopping out, man. I really do appreciate it. Have a good night, dude. Nate, what's up, man? You're alive. Did your stuff finish downloading? I feel like this isn't any faster than just... Like, running. Hold on, I need to... I changed my... Settings. Is it under gameplay? No. Where is... Oh, God. 
Oh, there it is. Controls. I changed my run button to one of the side mouse buttons because I thought it would be better, but it's not. I'm going to change it back to alt. There we go. It did. Nice, man. Have you started up a save then? Uh, we're close enough to here. Let's go ahead and put a thingy there. Hello, other person on horse. Fancy looking people. You did? Won't well, tell us about your build, man. What are you doing? Got anything fancy going on with it? Is that ore? Ugh. <laughs> this is why I don't usually ride a horse. <laughs> I can't help but stop. He's playing Skyrim. Wait, where's my... Hello, crab? Crab friend? Why can't my horse carry stuff? I need you to carry something. I would like my pickaxe, please. All right, back on horse. I guess it's technically faster, huh? Than walking, although it doesn't really feel faster. Oh, sorry. Muscle memory, I wanted to collect the bush. Did alternate life and started with Breeze Home and I'm doing survival, nice, nice. All good stuff, but you had to have made your character already, at least, right? So what race did you go with? Uh, I want to talk to you, but I can't because I'm on a horse. Excuse me, people. Nord, nice. Classic start. So I've played too many Nords. That's why I decided to go with the Red Guard. Wanted to do something a little different this time. <laughs> I'm so glad horses can just run up the sides of mountains, man. Is that where we're trying to get to? I'm guessing that's where I'm trying to get to. You're a Khajiit kind of guy? I'm not surprised. Seem like a Khajiit kind of guy. It will not let me off my horse here. What? How'd I get brown rot? I haven't been attacked by anything. Light and heavy armor prevent 50% less damage. Sleeping is 50% less restful. Oh my god! <laughs> Bro, that's terrible. Uh, I don't think I have any way of... Fixing that on me. I don't think there's like potion to cure disease in this game, right? There's poison. Seriously, how did I get. What do you mean cannot get this while in combat? Is there potion to cure disease? Hmm. I mean, I believe you, but I did not know that. I am not in combat game. Whatever. Where? Where is this combat that you speak of? Is it my horse? Am I fighting my horse? Anyways. Um. Well, shit. Now. Now we kind of need to go find a shrine. The mud crab you're worried? That's my mud crab, though. <laughs> he better not be trying to fight. This is where we're going? Yes. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Sorry, horse. I'll be honest. I didn't think that was a big drop for you. I'm going to get my horse killed. Yet another reason why I don't usually ride horses in this game. 
It's fine. Yeah, I got the crab follower. I don't like, like, people followers, so... <laughs> I forgot about the teleport pet spell. I could just use that instead of waiting. Oops. Oh, shit, I forgot to... Weapon. Favorite. Elven sword and equip. You friend? Your friend. Oh, no shit. That's really cool. I have to get that. The robot horse. Does it still take fall damage? Who the thieves... <laughs> Man gets a home, builds his homestead for like 30 seconds, and is like, you know what? This ain't the life for me. I want to steal some shit. <laughs> You don't think, wait, you don't think it takes fall damage? Or you don't think it's immune? Because if it doesn't take fall damage, that would be sick as hell. I forgot I had fire arrows equipped. You don't believe it takes fall damage? That's amazing! <laughs> oh, hi, you're alive. Oh, you're a lich, too. How did you dodge that? You're a bastard. Where are you going? Oh, there you are. Stop moving so much. <laughs> How did that... That phased right through him. Oh, you know, I might as well kill him with the bow to catch his soul takes damage I have seen the hearse the horse summon I feel like I could be mistaken but I'm pretty sure I've seen the horse summon before I however have not seen the uh, robotic horse that's pretty sick Everything's chill. Oh. Yeah, aren't both of them DLC? You're a bastard. Oh, bone meal. Man. Do you see me? Oh, you definitely see me. Can I get around you? Nope. Bro, I'm already cold enough. I don't need you spraying me with your frost shit here. You have so much health. Oh, I'm out of stamina. That's why I'm like barely attacking. Good stuff. Summon is Dawn Guard, Robot is Creation Club. Okay, that makes sense then. Because I've had the Dawn Guard DLC and played the game since. I've never done the Dawn Guard DLC, but I've definitely played a decent amount of the game after getting it. The Creation Club stuff, I only played, I don't know, maybe like 20 hours after getting the Creation Club stuff until now. Oh, that's the wrong spell. I do that a lot. Good, we good. Uh, shield and sword. Rotten Vale is your favorite Skyrim location? I really like Morrowind. I forget the name of the actual like DLC, but I just like the, the different locale and getting the ability to ride the dragon is sick as hell. It's the only DLC I've finished as well, so that's probably part of the reason why I really like it. 
I want, but I'm not going to take it. Too much weight. Uh, I guess we'll just follow around the right side here. Soul time, yeah. Soul time, however you pronounce it. Are you also frost, dude? Oh. More winds brown and empty. Yeah, I just like the like fauna or flora. Both, I guess, really. <laughs> like I like all the I like the the mushrooms and the uh the silt striders and all of that crap, you know? Although since the volcano erupted and everything's just covered in dust, it is a lot more brown, plain, drab, and dreary than it really should be. Nothing? Nothing? No, okay. It is empty up here. I think. Well, there could be something on those, though. Probably not. This is one of the reasons why I never finish a game of Skyrim. Oh, that's a chest. How do I get up there, though? Got to parkour real quick. Hold on. Hmm. I feel like I probably need the shout that like shifts you forward, or maybe going the other direction brings us out up there. Actually, hold on. Going back around. After you learned every effect of every alchemy ingredient, and you ain't doing that shit again. See, my problem is, is I always restart games of Skyrim, so I never got far enough to even do that, to get, like, every effect of every alchemy ingredient or anything like that. Aha! That was close. Mm, I'll take the gold and the soul gem, at least. The real question is, now that I have some more soul gems, should I enchant my elven sword here? Probably. I already have it upgraded to superior, which is pretty decent. I like this design. I'm, I'm guessing that's from the uh, immersive creatures mod. I don't recall ever seeing a female dragger, at least. You are peckish. Of course I'm peckish. Hmm. Value to weight of 30? Yeah, I'll take it. Wait, wait, wait. Doors of Oblivion? Definitely want. Also, if we find any of the lusty Argonian maid, gotta collect that. Because, you know, drag her. Yes. <laughs> As well drop a quick save too. Um That probably just opens this door, right? I don't feel safe pulling any switch in Skyrim. Oh, hi friends. <laughs> you guys look nice. Stop moving, stop moving. Oh, whatever, you're fine. Nice, one hit kill. I like it. Yeah, go check out your friend. Definitely stand right where they were standing when they died. That won't end poorly for you. Oh good, a white lord. Holy shit. Uh, where'd my weapon go? I want that bow back. Where's my shield? 
<laughs> I'm not a stealth Arthur, or Arthur, a stealth archer. They were just like perfectly laid out for it, man. Come on. Holy crap, you do some damage. Uh, hold on. Excuse me for a second while I run away. Oh shit, I rebound my keys. <laughs> I'm like, why can I not run? Okay, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming, and we're good. I can't cheese myself a free heal with the level ups because of survival mode. Oh no! You bastard. Oh god, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Ah, okay. Um, I have my hide shield. That's good, I guess. Go, 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 go. Where's sword? Where's sword? Sword? Sword. Uh. Oh, did it unfavorite it? Oh, that's rude. Whip that. And do we have any poisons? I mean, I don't think it's really going to do anything, but... I mean, guess. Oh my God, I'm gonna die. <laughs> this dude sucks so much. He does so much damage. No, you bastard. <laughs> Where's my sword? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I hate you so much, guy. He's so close to dying now. Get him, get him, get him, get him! <laughs> Holy balls, dude, you sucked. And you have nothing worth taking. Good stuff. Okay, well... Take the amethyst that I missed somehow. Got this chest at least, right? Yeah, okay, just didn't have anything in it. Man, that sucked. There goes all my health potions. Do you at least have anything in here worth looting outside of just like doing the quest? Arrows are garbage. Uh, I definitely need candlelight, please. Wasn't there two dudes that I killed in here? I guess the explosion must have, like, knocked one of them back or something? Somewhere? Empty, empty. Aha, there you are. You have nothing. Okay, well... This is fancy looking. Surprised we can't do anything with that? It really looks like we should be able to make some sort of sacrifice here or something, but whatever. What do I know? Are you trapped? No. Staff of reanimation. Reanimate a more powerful dead body to fight for you for 60 seconds? That's pretty sick. Is it worth eight pounds, though? To get the necromancy shit going early. In my game that I was doing uh, after the anniversary content came out, that's what I was doing as a, a mage that was focusing heavily on ne necromancy. Necromancy wasn't necessarily the goal that I had originally when I started, but it just ended up being too good and too fun to not play into it. Plus, it was like the new DLC stuff, so it just made sense. 
All right, well, considering that I'm in really bad shape because of the uh, rot that I have going on, I think we're going to go ahead and go back to Markarth, like, now. Why did that door close? That was weird. Who pulled the button? Was it you? Did you pull the chain or hit the button? I think that's Nomura's altar. Man, I want to, like, I used to watch a bunch of DLC or, ha or watch a DLC? No. Watch a bunch of lore videos for, uh... The Elder Scrolls lore, because it's actually really interesting, but I've forgotten, like, all of it. Because <laughs> my memory's terrible, like. Think you did a thing? There are no named corpses here, right? No. No, my goal was just to clear out the cave. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that's right. It's this lady. This is okay. This is the one, the uh, the Hall of the Dead that we went through to get to the Yarl or whatever. Um, we met her there. I remember. Okay. I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna, like, I'm just gonna tell him, like, hey, this is the thing that they're trying to do. They're trying to murder you or whatever and eat you. Because, <laughs> like, I'm not into the whole cannibalism thing with this character. Honestly, I should just kill her. I feel like that would be more this character's style. But I'm already gone, so I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm just going to tell the dude what's going on. I don't want to be a cannibal. Not with this guy. I have nothing against being a cannibal in video games. I do it a lot in Fallout, but <laughs> this character's not a cannibal. Uh, map. Oh my god, game. I know I can't fast travel but I should be able to put a thing down still. Uh, road. Oh, hey, horse. I'm going to take the horse back to the stable, and then honestly, I'm probably done with the horse already. It's nice to have one, I guess, in case... Oh, God, it's a bear. I'm not going to fuck with the bear right now. You know what? I take it back. Where's the bear? Uh, shield. <laughs> Good horse! <laughs> Kill the bear! <laughs> I want his hide, like. <laughs> Your honor, if you are what I eat, then my client is an innocent man. <laughs> I'm sure that'll hold up in court. Wait, where'd my horse go? Game? Where'd he go? He was, okay, there he is. I was gonna say, he was just here fighting. Don't tell me he got scared and ran away. See, it's so much harder to pick all these flowers <laughs> and juniper berries because I'm on the back of a horse. We're just going to leave him in the stables where he can be nice and comfy, live with his horse friends and all that. There's a mud crab freaking out down there that I can't do anything with. A bunch of saber cats that really want to eat that mud crab. I kind of want more souls. Oh, that's. Oh, never mind. Wait, what are you, Wella? Stop hurting my horse! There you go. Yeah, come for me. 
I want your souls, please. Thank you. What am I? Oh god, there's mud crabs everywhere. Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. Ooh, that mud crab had an amethyst. Do you guys have hides? You do. And a bunch of fire arrows. Okay, where's my horse now? There he is. It's okay, buddy. I wonder if wild healing. Wild healing heals like you and a random person near you. Yeah, it can heal the horse. Nice. I have no idea how much horse, how much horse, how much health the horse has, but it still feels good to give him some healing. Who are you? You've just been ch chilling here. I thought you were like with the group when I passed you last time, but the liar. Hmm. Well, you don't care to talk, so whatever. Gotta go. Thank you, man, for stopping out. I appreciate it, especially tonight. Ha. Hope the rest of your work shift goes well, my guy. There's a Nern root. I want it. Oh, and I just saw a nest with an egg. I want the egg. Okay, turn in quest. Or not, I guess not turn in quest, but tell the dude what's going on and see what happens from there. And then it is after three, I'm assuming, because Chocobo's leaving. Yeah, so that'll probably be it for the night. I'm going to pee. Update the save on my Steam Deck, because I'll probably be playing Sky... Oh, wait. I probably can't take the horse into the city. There we go. Good boy, horse. I'm a little stuck. There, there we go. I don't even remember who you are. Hmm. Right. Wait, can I have the dog and the... Do I still have the mud crab? I should have saved first, but teleport. I do. I just saw. Yes, let's go. Okay. Oh, uh, but the dog can't carry anything. Oh, whatever. I'll have him wait in my house then. Is he coming? Yeah, there he is. The okay, first thing we actually need to do is heal ourselves of the stupid rot that we have going on. Who are you? I don't remember you. Oh, you're a beggar. No, I'm not. I'm not stealing the statue. <laughs> Sorry. I'll give you a gold coin if you want, but... I'm not stealing the statue. Is it this one? It's a shrine of Talos. It's still a shrine, right? My friend's dead body still in here? No, they must got rid of it. All diseases cured. Thank you, game. Yeah, they must got rid of the body. I mean, it makes sense that they would. Vigilance. I wish the dog could carry stuff. It makes sense that it can, I guess, but I mean the mud crab can. It doesn't make a ton of sense that the mud crab could carry stuff, so why not the dog? Did I get any crafting stuff that matters? Some hides that I could do some stuff with. I did get some silver ore. I can make a couple more, uh, whatchamacallits. Pieces of jewelry. Oh, 
Hello, my guy. I didn't think you were ever going to get on, to be honest with you. Thought you done died or something. Need a new blade? Silver amethyst necklace. Yes. Ruby ring. Amethyst necklace. Whatever. Just want to get rid of the stuff. Do you like the work I was doing there, Gorza? <laughs> Getting awfully close, my guy. Had to stay a little late, sir. A little late? It is 3 o'clock in the morning? <laughs> That's not a little late? And here. Hall of the Dead. Brother of Arulius, or whatever the hell your name is. Where are you? You're here somewhere. Aha. I could have just used that shrine, I guess. Kind of forgot it was here. Whatever. Now, I want to tell him the truth. Can I just tell him the truth? Hold on. F5. Quick save. Mm. Never mind then. Okay. So, here's what we need to do then. I'm going to mark it on the map because I'm definitely going to forget before I come back and play again. But I need to go to Reach Cliff Cave and kill the person. Can I make a note? No. I can on Steam. I wonder, though, if the notes carry over. Jill? No. Jill, Eola, and... What was it called? Reach Cliff? Reach Cliff? Question mark? Cave. There we go. Yeah, Reach Cliff. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, because I'm not going to, like... Get this dude murdered if I can help it. Ah, uh, you know what? It is after three. Should we just... No, it's fine. Okay, it's fine. I'm gonna go do my stuff. I'm gonna go sell my stuff and all that crap. Or you know what? It's pointless. That's dumb. <laughs> Nobody wants to watch me just sell stuff anyways, so... I think we're just gonna call it there. Sorry to leave, like, as soon as you get here, my guy, but you are super late, so, you know, what do you expect? <laughs> and in the meantime, I might look up and see if it's possible to do anything with Brother Virulius or Virulus. I thought the game would let us, like, tell him, you know, that, hey, uh, Yola wants to eat you. <laughs> or something, you know, but nothing. It won't let me, it won't let me tell him. There's just not an option for it. Wow. Wow. Wow, indeed, on you being so late, my guy. little late at work. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. You're crazy. Ah. Uh, I'll be on mine, though, still, if you want to play something for a little bit, my guy. I don't know what your plans are for tonight, if you're going to bed or what, but... Anyways. That's it for me tonight, guys, for the birthday stream. Thank you for coming and hanging out while I played some uh, Skyrim. It's been a ton of fun. I am super excited to actually, like, play Skyrim on stream with the more restrictive uh rules and all that stuff but you know that'll be at some point in the future so until then have a good night everyone especially optijack i guess <laughs> i will see you possibly tomorrow but definitely friday because i'll be i'll be gone for a few days so until then be kind to each other y'all bye i need a shift tab out of here there we go goodbye <laughs> You too, Nate. Night, broski. Grows. If you don't tend to it quickly enough, it will expire. Like, it will go bad. So you, you need to, like, pick it pretty quickly after...